Hey, welcome back guys. My name is Anodem Kilaini. I'm going to show you how to create a simple spinner button using Android Studio, which is the programming language Java. So I have a, we have the procedures here. So I'll show you. We have three procedures. That means we go for layout, then strings, then activity. So coming back to my Android Studio programming actual interface. So I have my employees information. So I want to put like gender sex, for instance, a user should choose either male or female. So from, from the start, you just have seen the procedures you need to have a layout fixed already so i'll go to the layouts i'll choose the layout horizontal and drag and drop on my left component tree side then i'll just reformat it uh, it should be below age and i keep it here for instance 30 yes this is okay and 15 yeah so there you are so now i'll drag and drop my text view so that the user can know that this is where sex option should be selected because i said that it will be a selection of gender Okay, there you are. So I have sex. Then I'll go to my containers so that I can drag and drop my spinner button. So drag and drop my spinner button. Don't worry. Sex is just squished there on the left. Just have to maximize it a little bit here. And there you are. Then you come to your linear layout. Then wrap content so that you can fix somewhere like this. So we're done with the layout. Now we need to go to the strings as the second procedure directs us. So to the strings, you need first to double click here strings. And on the here at the bottom, then we'll start right string array. Here it is. Then enter. Then the name I will call it gender. Okay. Then we close this way. Yes. Then enter. Now in between now this way we run up. We want to write a small code. So this is where you select options, for instance, yes or no. Or for a case now it's gender, it will be either male or female. So I'll start with item then okay then it will be it will be male male sorry male here you are then another one it will be okay then close then it will be female yeah there you are so my strings is done so now the, th the third procedure we need to go to activity so that we can punch our code there. So coming back to our activity employees, we need for us to know what's the name of the spinner button. So it's spinner 5. So let us change it to spinner, let us call it spinner gender, right? Yes. Now we going back to our code now here from the employees. So I double click employees. So here now from the, now we want to write our code. I will comment first. This is spinner gender 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 so, okay now we start so upon starting as a spinner yes then spinner yes yeah, small letters then find view rd ara dot id dot spinner we have it already spinner gender is it's shown here already then over there then you come to array adapter see then cache frequency here yeah, at the bottom yes then adapter which is equal to array adapter dot create from resources this yeah array dot array now what's the name now this is the name of the 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 options which are selected so it is gender you see so i'm selecting gender here and there you are then comma then android then android dot r dot layout yes dot simple spinner that on the top and simple spinner item so then we close it yes now you know you have we need to close this then we go back now again to adapter so that to adapt dot set drop down set drop down view resources yeah there you are okay then android dot ara dot layout dot simple now it will be a drop down inside the top one drop down item 
then now you're done so you just have to call it now the last code which is pina the small letter the one this one here so it's selecting it knows itself then dot set adapter then you write there we adapt uh, the adapter here which is here at the bottom so here you are so you need you have already finished now from this will be the end of the simple small code so we'll try to run and see how this works so when i now run my virtual android device so upon running this is how it works okay so this is my android okay so upon clicking employees information you see now we have sex either male or female so this is how to do it you just choose so we've just created a simple spinner button using our android studio okay guys thank you hope you understood welcome back again don't forget to